Hello Internets. I have a huge mailbox segment coming up, but uh, before I do that, I just wanted uh, to mention a quick word about a gadget which I acquired because I care, I care deeply about the quality of Chris's mailbox, and I want to make sure that my, my many, many uh, twos of viewers have the best possible experience. And so in order to do that, um, I have acquired the Atomos Ninja 2, which I hold here in my hand. And I, I thought I would make a very, very quick review of this product. Um, this is a, what do they actually call it? There's a bunch of different ways you could refer to this. They call it a camera mounted recorder, monitor, and deck for HDI cameras and DSLRs. Sure. Um, I was looking for an HDMI recorder, and you'll see why in the next huge mailbox video. Uh, I want the ability to record the output of a computer. So, in my particular case, I have a small PC which uh, outputs HDMI to a monitor. And that small PC, uh, I would like to I would like to basically screen capture what I'm doing with that computer, but without running screen capture software on the computer, as it's not capable of doing a lot more with the CPU. And I like the idea of not bogging it down. So it occurred to me that I could get one of these things. See here on the side, there are some HDMI ports. You plug the video in. You plug the video out if you want to loop it through so you can continue displaying it in your monitor. You put in you put in this slot here a hard drive. So this comes with a, a little um, box into which you install a 2.5 inch SATA hard drive or in this case uh, SSD. Well, and if I put it in here correctly Anyway, you just pop this drive into the slot, very easy. Um, I have a battery here, which I have to reach over the counter for. Pardon me. I didn't plan very well. The battery, the battery charger. Okay, there we go. I have the battery here. So, this has uh, space for two batteries, by the way, so that you can um, essentially operate it continuously. When one battery gets low, it switches to the other one. You can take that battery off, replace that with a full one, etc. Or you can, it comes with an AC adapter. It actually comes with a lot of stuff. It comes with the battery, it comes with two of these hard drive uh, sleds. It comes with an AC adapter. It comes with a standalone battery charger. So you don't have to charge the battery by plugging a cable into this thing. Um, and it comes with a USB adapter to the computer for, for these hard drives. So, um, yeah, you've got everything you need to, to view it back. I don't know what I was looking for there. Uh, so I was going to say, anyway, you turn this on. Turn this on. And you plug your video into it. And uh, it records. So it's intended. It's got... It's got um, tripod mounts on the top and the bottom so it's really intended to go on your camera essentially and record the video output from your camera but uh, I can also use it for my application so if I play this here uh, you probably won't be able to see this but that is my desktop from my computer from when I was testing this just set the computer because of the specs on this. It does 1080p 30 frames per second maximum or 1080i 60 frames per second, but you don't want an interlace from a computer. So I set the computer to output 1080p 30. Boom, works perfectly. Uh, records directly into Apple ProRes 422. Uh, a couple different quality versions of that as well as some Avid codec I'm not familiar with. So when you're done, you simply pop the hard drive out attach it to your computer, and boom, there are your files ready for your nonlinear editing software. So, I'm uh, quite happy with this so far. I haven't used it in anger. Uh, I'm going to actually record a video with it just after this one, and we'll see how it works when I when I try to edit it in. But yeah, it's got 
It's got, I think, four channels of audio. Um, it's got a bunch, no, it's, I guess it's two channels. I'm not entirely sure. There's a bunch of touchscreen controls, so you can you can set all the audio stuff, you can monitor the video, there's a bunch of, uh, you know, you can do um, different kinds of video monitoring, um, and yeah, not much else to say about it. So, I'm happy with my Atomos Ninja 2. No promotional consideration was given by Atomos. Oh, and the other thing I forgot it comes with, uh, it comes with a couple of different adapters. So, this is a uh, Nikon D800, uh, and this is a Canon 5D Mark III. So I guess the idea is if you already have one of those batteries, or several of those batteries, because you're a video or camera person, you probably have like stacks of batteries. So you can put these adapters on and you can use a, those on here, because I believe these are Sony batteries. So chances are, you you know, if you're a camera person, you probably even have batteries lying around that you can use with this. I don't. Um, I don't even need to run it off battery, because I'm not portal. Anyway, I've talked way too much. I want to make my mailbox video, so I'm going to stop now, stop talking about this, and I'll see you later on the mailbox.